Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, welcome to Chris's Southern Home Tours. We're over here at Worldwide Mobile Homes in Lumberton, Texas. And again, I do not work for them. And today we're going to check out this single lot over here. This is called the Bobby Joe. Uh, I believe it's a three bedroom. I could be wrong, it could be a two bedroom. I had never been inside, so we're going to explore this one together. And yeah. So. This is a nice little home right here. It's a vinyl siding all the way around. Right here at this front end, this front side over here, you got actual metal, sheet metal right there. It's got shingle roofing. It's kind of hard for me to get a good outside view of it because these homes are pretty close together. So, but you got your, uh, AC disconnects right there and your outlets and all your hookups and everything's gonna be back there. But yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and get on into it, shall we? Alright. So how's y'all's weekend going? I hope y'all having a great one. Hope everybody's being staying safe out there. The world's getting kind of crazy. So Alright, so let's go ahead and check this sucker out. Now, as I'm walking up, see this door. This is a really nice door for a mobile home, you know? It just, it's got the real house feel to it. Got the windows in it. Real nice. Oh man, I love this. This is a great entranceway. You got your coat racks right there, for your little cubby hose on there. Perfect spot for the kids to put their backpacks and stuff like that in the mornings before they go out for school. Yeah. Man. Look at the liver. And the beams. Wow, that's nice. Faulted ceiling. Real nice. They did very well with the space in this one. Um, Really impressed, actually. Got your entertainment wall right there. It's not super fancy, but it's really nice, though. You can probably put a little electric fireplace underneath there. And check out that island. Holy cow. You don't have no room in here for a dining room table or nothing. But I guess that island makes up for it. Yeah, check out that. There's plenty of cabinet space all the way around. Got the metal range hood right there over the stove. Plenty of seats for the kiddos. Oh yeah, look at the backsplash, that's pretty cool. That's all fully tiled and goes all the way around. You got plenty of cabinets in here, sucker man. That's what I'm talking about. So, what y'all think of the Bobby Joe so far? Huh? It's really, uh, I like the paint, the paint scheme in here. It's very welcoming. It feels very warm in here, you know? I mean, it does feel warm in here. It's like 80 something degrees outside. But, I mean, besides the point. You got plenty of outlets to check that out all the way around. You got a nice farmhouse style sink right here. Got your dishwasher, fridge. And that's the cool part though, because you don't have that sink in the middle of the counter. So now you can use this whole island for food prep and all kinds of stuff. So that's great. So you got plenty of space. I mean, God, this thing is huge. I'm like, damn. A bit overkill, huh? I love the windows right here. That's beautiful for the natural lighting. Awesome. I'm a big fan of natural lighting. That was every one of my videos. I'm talking about it. You got your, uh, this is right here where your air handler would go. All right. And down the hallway, we're going to start off with this one right here to the right. This will be your laundry room. 
It's a good size laundry room. You got a portion of drawer hookups right here. You got your wire rack right there. I'm sure you can put in some shelvings and some other good stuff in here, you know? Like, you could put your dryer right there on that wall. I guess. You have, a, you have a plug in right here. I don't know if you'll be able to squeeze in a freezer in here or not. You might be able to. Maybe an upright freezer, I would think. A stand up one. Yeah. And I noticed, like, in the uh, back over here in the kitchen area, you don't have a pantry. But you can use part of the laundry room as part of the pantry too, you know. You can put in some shelving in there and uh, store some canned goods and stuff. All right, so yeah, this is going to be a three bedroom, two bath. So I'm going to first walk into the first guest bedroom. Get your light switches and everything like that. Little outlet right there. This is a small little room though. I mean, of course, we're in a single lot, so it's not gonna be stupid huge or nothing. But yeah, that's nice. Tell me what y'all think of it so far. Y'all drop me a comment down below. Don't forget to smash that like button either. Your guest bathroom with the transom window over the uh, single piece tub and shower combo. Got your toilet, your cabinets with a squared porcelain sink. It doesn't have a mirror in here right now, but I'm sure it comes with that. I just don't have it up. Yeah, or you can just. Yeah. And this is the uh, second guest bedroom. Oh, there you go. This one, of course, is bigger. Just. Your closet. This is a very really nice home as well. This is for you know a smaller family or a small couple, you know. That uh good starter home. You can turn this little room right here into a little office or something. It does come with the Eagle B thermostats. Check out those light fixtures over the uh oh, man, that's nice. I like those little light fixtures right here too on the other on each side of the uh, entertainment wall. That's really cool. And then you got this metal. That's pretty neat. I like how they come up with these little neat little things for these homes, you know. Each home is different, each home is unique. This is nice too. Now you got your some more shelvings right here. Perfect for linen or towels and stuff for guests. It's real nice. It's a nice little entrance way into the master bathroom. Kind of makes me feel like I'm about to walk into something really nice. And here's your master bedroom. And with the four cracks in the wall right there. That's not gonna be with the home. <laughs> no. This is a pretty good size master bath bedroom. Oh yeah. And then we're gonna walk in here. There's your master bath. You got the silver tub right there. Really nice. Got those cabinet spaces right there. It's got a single piece. That's just a single uh, sink right there. It's for a porcelain. Plenty of counter space. Plenty of cabinet space as well. That plumbing doesn't take up all the room in there. Of course, this room doesn't have a mirror right now either. And then you got your toilet. 
And then the shower. Shower's not very fancy. But yeah. You get the idea. Yeah. And then the master closet. It's in the bathroom. I know some people don't like their closet in the bathroom. Some people do. I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence with it, so. Kind of do, and I kind of don't either. Uh, I get the idea of your clothes are already in the bathroom, so when you get up in the morning to go to work, you know, you come in, get your clothes, you're already in the bathroom, you finish brushing your teeth, get dressed, you know. Ladies can do their makeup right there, so, yeah. But yeah, this is the Bobby Joe, and it is a gorgeous three-bedroom, two-bath home, and... Over here at Worldwide Mobile Homes in Lumberton, Texas. Again, I do not work for them. And yeah. So for this home, this is an awesome price. So check this out. This home is going for $98,995. Yep. Of course, that includes the delivery, setup, AC, installation, skirting, temporary steps, all that good stuff. Um, the pricing may vary depending on your location again, you know, freight count, you know, freight charges, county regulations, all that good old junk. So, but yeah, y'all tell me, y'all tell me uh, what y'all think of the home. And I think that's a great price for it as well. So yeah, drop me a comment down below. Tell me what y'all think and smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon for more notifications for whenever I come out with new videos just like this. Alright everybody, I hope y'all have a blessed day and enjoy it. Peace.